clay tonic. This is a steel tongue drum. I think it sounds amazing, so today I'm going to make a sample pack out of it. It'll be available on my website as a free download, just the raw files, or as a Reason NNXT patch, or an Ableton sampler preset. I did some research before making this video and I found out that this is a very recent instrument. The, the first one was made in America by a man named Dennis Havlena in February of 2007 out of the bottom of a propane tank. I can't help but admire his DIY sensibilities. Also, this instrument is what's known as an idiophone, which is defined by the Merriam-Webster dictionary as, and I quote, any of a class of musical instruments, such as a bell or gong, whose sound is generated by striking, rubbing, plucking, or blowing the material of the instrument itself, not under any special tension. In other words, this instrument does not have a string or a resonator. It is in and of itself the string and the resonator, and all you do is make it make a sound by hitting it. Musically speaking, this instrument is tuned to eight notes of a major pentatonic scale, or minor, depending on where you start. It has three tongues or notes that are octaves of each other. And obviously you can tell that the smaller tongues are much harder to get to ring at their true tone. I'll put a couple links down in the description of the Wikipedia article I found for the steel tongue drum and of a website that I found that was dedicated that gave a little bit more information if any of you are curious. It came with this mallet that you're supposed to use to hit the tongs, but for the sake of getting a couple different timbers, I'm going to use the mallet like you're supposed to with a little rubber tip. I'm going to use the handle of said mallet, giving it a much brighter tone, and I'm going to use the side of my thumb too. Pulls out different harmonics for some reason. I am not a drummer or a percussionist, but I will do my best to be consistent and record each tongue at three different uh, intensities, dynamics, or once we get into software, velocity levels. As far as the capture itself is concerned, I will be using this blue ember uh, about 10 inches from the drum itself, straight on axis. And I'll be using this CM25 Mark II from uh, Folkstrike Scarlet. This is the microphone that comes with the Scarlet 2i2 when you buy the bundle. And it will be about the same distance from the drum, but about 45 degrees off axis. Both of these microphones will be recorded into Ableton Live 11 through the Scarlet 2i2 sitting on the desk behind me. Some quick math, three velocity levels, three different mallets, that's nine samples per note times two because of two microphones, that's 18 per note, times eight different notes, that'll be 144 samples out of this little blue drum. Okay, first off, the rubber end of the mallet. Next up is the handle of the mallet. Last up, just the thumbs.
As I said at the beginning of this video, all of these instruments and samples will be available as a download from my website. I'll put a link in the description. If you are unable to make any kind of purchase at this time, I encourage you to please feel free to download whatever you would like and go make some music. But if you are able, I ask that you would make a donation to support me and my work. I have been Claytonic. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you next time.